Good morning. Rain or shine, summer is swinging into high gear. This weekend's Dragon Boat races continue at Suyalana Lagoon, and if you head down to Mafia Sutton Park, you'll find music and dance performances, food trucks, a kids' play area, and even a beer garden. This is just the first high-profile summer event. The Silly Boat Regatta is a week from today. That's followed by the Nanaimo Marine Festival and bathtub racing the July 24th weekend. We're heading in the wrong direction on a one-way road when it comes to building a united country and creating prosperity for the future. A new survey from Nanos Research shows half of those surveyed believes Canada is on the wrong track and only 22% believe we're on the right track. Prairie residents led the pessimism with 60% believing we're on the wrong path. In BC, 42% feel we're going in the wrong direction. The Rogers Network crash should be a major wake-up call for all of us. One technology expert says serious changes are needed. He says this is critical infrastructure for Canadians. It's not just having a bad day. There's critical business processes, financial systems, hospital emergency systems, and more that are impacted. And if you daydream about owning a yacht, cruising on one or even just seeing one, head down to the port of Nanaimo and take a gander at about two dozen being unloaded here. Nanaimo and Victoria are the preferred locations for yachts being returned to the West Coast because of the experience of the terminal operator and the longshoreman. Most of the yachts are destined for Seattle or Alaska, with a few staying in BC. A second vessel is scheduled to deliver another load of yachts next week. And in our opinion section, John Felstead says he's had it with the Prime Minister's constant hollow apologies. And Brian Peckford talks about his favorite subject, our Charter of Rights. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. Weather.com says we're in for a week of sunshine and dry weather.